see, I tell you, I don't know how Batman gets down pose like that. He's incredibly uncomfortable. But however, welcome along to another. Now you see a complete ham pickle worth of sandwiches and grid games and all sorts of fun and games we're going to do with words. We're going to put two teams yet again head to head, try and get through to the final later on the series to win some fabulous prizes. Let's meet this week's two teams. Right, we've got Hillhead High playing against Dal Keith High. So let's have our first game. It's the grid game. So Dick, if you don't mind, come out the first grid, please. <laughs> Right, so here we are. You familiar with the rules, are you both? Both schools ready? Poised and ready to go? Remember, I'll be asking you questions. You just find the answers that'll fit into the grid. OK, you've got uh, as much time as you can to get through this, as many points as you want. Right, the first question is colour of a classroom board. Black. Custy. Black. It is indeed. Well done. Don't even need to give you a letter. Another name for the pavement. Andrew. Carp. Carp it is. Well done. This lives in a hive. Andrew. B. B, simple as that. Your arm joint. Kirsty. Elbow. Elbows connect to the B, not correct. Uh, next grid, please. A precious metal. Andrew. Gold. Good guess, you're quite correct. A pet swimmer kept in a bowl. Kirsty. Goldfish. Goldfish it is. Resting place for a book. Ross. Shelf. It is. The number of people in a quintet. Ross. Five. Spot on. Another grid, please, Dick. Name for a train. Name for a train. Not Chuff Chuff. Chardit. Sorry? Locomotive. Uh, we'll give you that, we'll give you that. No, we won't, no, we won't. We'll give you a letter instead. Cut down Keith High. Loco. Loco, yes. A black or white drink. Andrew. Coke. Sorry? Cola. No, it's not cola. Down Keith Ross, can you come in? Coffee. Coffee, spot on. Uh, the boss of a newspaper. Ross again. Editor. It is. A type of ball. A type of ball. Difficult one, this. I'll give you another letter. I can't give you another letter because we're at the end of the grid. Nobody going to get this? It's or We'll move on to the next one. Another question quickly. He lives in an igloo. Ross. Out of time, Ross. We just about had that. It was actually Eskimo, of course. Bit of a simple one there. OK, let's have a look at the scores after this first round, Dick. In off to a flyer mode, Hillhead High have six. And Dalkeith High have 16. <laughs> OK, so uh, moving on to the next round now. Hillhead High, you're just slightly lagging behind, so we're going to let you go first. This is the circle and see it round. Of course, you've got to have your BDI on the grid in front of you. So if you don't mind, Dick, can we have the first grid, please? <laughs> OK, so Churnjeet and Andrew, you have your grid in front of you. Who's drawing? Mm -hmm. You're taking the pen, Andrew, so have it in your hand and ready to go. Remember, you must circle it and you must see it before we can give out both points, OK? All right, so time starts now. Just married. Just married. Wed. Wed is well done. Mum and Dad's boy. Son. Son, spot on. What do you make when you cut the cake? Wish. Wish it is. Well done. Give you that. It's hottest in summer. It's hottest in Sun. summer. Sun. Well done. The capital of France. Paris. That's right. A female sheep. You. OK. Use this to cool down. Pass. Pass on the next one. Glue or syrup is this. Sticky. Well done. Workman's shoes. Workman's shoes. Boots it is, well done. Quickly in the last batch of time. Panda foods. Panda foods. Bamboo. Bamboo, well done. Say this to scare someone. <laughs> oh, just out of time there. Hard lines, it was boo there. Let's see in the ones that you didn't quite get, Chunji and Andrew. There was fan there. And that was it. You only passed on one. You just failed to get boot at the end. However, we shall move on. Down, Keith, it's your turn. You're poised and ready to go. Dick, could we have the grid, please? <laughs> OK, Down, Keith, hi. You have your grid. Ross, you've got a firm grip of that pen, so I presume you're writing? Yep. Yep. Yep, just say yep, Grant, that'll do. Now, remember, you've got to circle it, you've got to say it, and then we'll give you the points, OK? If you're not happy, pass, and we'll move on. Right, your time starts now. Very fat. Very fat. Pass. Pass on the next one. To pierce with something pointed. Stab. Well done. A routine task. 
day-to-day -day routine task. Pass. Pass on the next one. Part of a song or poem? Verse. Verse is well spotted. 1992 Formula One champion. Mansell. Mansell it is. Repetition of a sound. Repetition of a sound. Pass. Pass on the next one. To give the meaning of a word. Define. Define, well done. The largest brass instrument. Tuba. Quickly out of time. To search into or examine something closely. Probe. Probe is well done. A mineral wood shield metal. Christy, well done from Dale Keith High. Let's recap on the ones that you didn't quite get. There was obese there, it's another word for fat, chore, day-to-day -day work, and echo, 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 echo. So there you go, Dale Keith and Hillhead. Let's have a little recap of the scores, please. And they are in the present tense. Dale Keith High have 46, Hillhead High have 51. <laughs> Right, well, it's hotting up, it's hotting up. There's only one round to go and there's not a lot of points separating Hillhead and Dal Keith. We have the final grid game to go. So, Dick, if you don't mind, can you fly it in, please? <laughs> OK, so here we go in the final one. Dal Keith and I just slightly behind. So remember, the way to get your points is spot the word, say its line, its position and the word itself. You've got to say it in that order or we can't give you the points. We've got two and a half minutes. This is a fast scoring round. You want to get as much as you can this time, and your time starts now. A pleasant smelling liquid put on the wrists. Kirsty. Line three, position one, perfume. It is. James Bond was a secret one. Ross. Line one, position five, agent. He was indeed. This vegetable makes you cry. Kirsty. Line two, position ten, onion. It is. The long hair on a horse's neck. Kirsty. Line four, position eleven, main. Mm hmm. A word which means attempt. Kirsty again. Line one, position nine. Try. It is. Doors and gates hang on this. Andrew. Line four, position five, hinge. It is, well done. The place where you go in. The place where you go in. Ross. Line one, position seven, entry. It is. Not fact. Not fact. Ross. Line two, position five, fiction. It is, well done. Terry Waite was one in Beirut. Chunji. Line one, position one, hostage. Well done. The nationality of Boris Becker, Ross. Line four, position eight, German. Well done, just. A posh name for a man. Ross again. Line one, position six, gent. Oh, yes, indeed. Right, Dick, could we change over the board game for this, please? Right, a volcano in Sicily. Nope, line two, position nine, Etna. Opposite of on, Kirsty. Line three, position one, off. Yeah, well done. Y you'll find one in Egypt. Andrew. Line three, position six, pyramids. Yeah, you'll find more. You need, to, you need a hammer to bang it in. Ross. Line two, position 11, nail. Yeah. Prisoners are kept here. Andrew. Line one, position eight, cell. Yeah, well done. A male sheep. Mail sheep. Nope. Line three, position eight. I'm giving it out already. And it's ram. Line three, position eight, ram. English word for lock. Ross. Line one, position 11, lake. Well done. A good thought. A good thought. Andrew. Line three, position 11, idea. Well done. An island in the Mediterranean. Ross. Line four, position one, Angora. No, it's not. Andrew. Line two, position one, creep. Spot on. Quickly, a goat, a rabbit with long hair. <laughs> I'm excited on that one. Oh, it's always the quick one. It's always one when you can try and catch your breath the last ever round. Let's see how the scores have changed now. In hairy, scary finale mode, Hillhead High have 97, and Dalkeith High win today with 158. <laughs> I can tell you, actually, with that score that you guys just scored there in Dalkeith, you've actually gone into second position 
and our leaders board. So you've actually pushed out Turnbull High uh, with their 127. They're now in fifth place. So well done. We'll see how those scores change, if at all, next week when we join us again for Now You See It. Bye-bye. <laughs>